even this horrific disaster in Florida, what are you already starting to hear from Democrats in these TV shows and these hosts? Besides what you're going to hear in this clip that's just unbelievable from Jennifer Granholm today, but you're also hearing what? Well, maybe we need more regulation. Maybe we need more course, regulation. Of but course. No, no. Maybe we need more inspection. Maybe we need more upkeep. Maybe we need a lot of things that we're learning about this building. The one thing we have zero evidence of, not to ruin the clip, is that climate change had something to do with this and less more regulation would have had something to do in, in helping this situation. That's the last thing we need. Right, climate change, right. Yeah, okay. Let's right. just play it. I, I can't even, <laughs> let's just get right to it. Cut nine, G. This is, now CNN, of course, brings her on knowing exactly the direction they're going to go with this discussion. And the idea that they would bring on the energy secretary to talk about this situation and frame the questions like this to push their agenda is mind-boggling. Roll this clip. In terms of in terms of climate, you brought up what's happening, what we're seeing in the Pacific Northwest. Um, All right, well, stop it. What are we seeing in the Pacific Northwest, by the way? It's hot. What are we seeing in the Northeast right now? It's hot. What, what are we seeing in the Pacific Northwest? We're seeing record-breaking temperatures, right? Anything else? What else are we seeing? The, the, even the way she frames the question, what we're seeing in the Pacific, what are we seeing? They won't, they don't talk specifics. Don't you believe this? <laughs> believe right. it gets hot in the summer? My goodness. Wow. Especially in the deserts. Oh, I Go can't ahead. believe the deserts are hot in the summer. Hot about what happened in Florida at the Surfside condominium building. That Immediate collapsed. correlation. We don't know exactly what happened at this point. But given what we know about the changing climate, given that we've seen an increase in these so-called extraordinary tides and the impact that that can have in areas like South Florida, okay, just do you hold think it. that... <laughs> <laughs> extraordinary <laughs> tides? Just, just... It's an extraordinary tide of BS is what she's pushing. Exactly. I mean, the, she has I... no idea what she's saying. <laughs> it's, the, just, I... it's so funny how they are given their corporate script to go... And that what, what, the first commercial break is probably like, this has been brought to you by GE's Electric Green Energy. Now, this segment is brought to you by some... BS, it's such nonsense. The it's idea that we have any say or can do anything about what she's talking about, tides rising, lowering, coming in, going out, getting higher, getting lower, getting hotter, getting cooler, that somehow that we man is going to affect this is just, but again, that to me is not even, that's the smaller overall point of the whole agenda we've talked about forever. But the idea that they make a correlation, she flips out this, we're seeing in the north, no idea what she's talking about other than the heat. Then she correlates it right to Florida and then push the agenda and then here we go. Roll it, G. At climate could have played a role in that building's collapse. <laughs> well, obviously, we don't know fully, but we do know that, that the seas are rising. I mean, we know that we're losing inches and inches and, of and beaches. We, and and we know that there's Florida, nothing but... we can do about it. The seas are rising. The seas are declining. The seas are this. The seas are that. What does the seas rising have to do when with we... With Obama buying a house on Martha's Vineyard or... <laughs> yeah. We were told 12 years ago that, that the coast would we be had underwater. That list. Remember that list you read of all the ways we're going to die? Yes. From... <laughs> I wish we had that still. Oh, uh, Manhattan was supposed to be underwater by now. Right. I don't think that happened. Right. Uh, the killer bees was supposed to take us all out by now. We have, we have actually learned facts. Some facts are starting to come out about this horrific tragedy that they're using to push an agenda here in this segment. And they knew that this is where they were going to go. And this is, they knew they, this is where she stood. And that this is the direction she was going to go. The idea that climate change had something to do with this it's just beyond my ability to even understand. 